Hey folks, it's Ivy Rivera, Psychic Medium, coming to you with your weekly horoscopes for all zodiac signs, sun, moon, and rising. I am a Taino Arawak, a psychic, a medium, and I use the planetary movements to help guide me in whatever information your particular zodiac sign needs to know about so that you can maximize your prosperity. Enjoy. Aries, what is going on with you this week? Monday the 16th, there's talk of maternal energies living in deceased trying to direct you to close a door on a chapter that does not seem to be bringing you any fruition. This, for some of you, Sun, Moon, or Rising Aries will be in a really important relationship, possibly even a love partnership that is off to the past or has been back and forth. Uh, for others, it may be a mental, emotional issue, but it is definitely time to close that chapter. Tuesday the 17th, Wednesday the 18th, there's talk of over the hump day and for many of you, this is going to be in love, and for others, it's going to be in life in general. Several different areas, finally um, getting to a place where you've done the hard work, the heavy lifting, and the tug of war is over. Wednesday the 18th into Thursday the 19th, there's talk of a mutual theme on both of these days having to do with words and communication. Words are answers. They're also solutions to problems, and there's a lot to talk here of detail, pay attention to it, and contracts. So it's definitely time to reread, listen very carefully, pay attention to what's coming out of others or things that you see. Friday the 20th, Saturday the 21st, Sunday the 22nd, and for some of you, even Monday the 23rd, which is huge. So in my readings, this is a four-day stretch, which means major change in at least one area of your life. Now, not everybody has earned this, and I'll break that down as we get closer to the Sunday, Monday here. Let's start with uh, the Friday, Saturday, Sunday, though. This is about staying focused pushing your agenda ahead, understanding that the universe is backing you. Now, in order to do that and to reap the benefits of this level up that's right around the corner on Friday the 20th and Saturday the 21st, you have to be able to tune out the toxics. And I felt that when they wrote toxics, they were mostly talking about other people, naysayers, uh, negative situations that never seem to resolve themselves and be mindful of your own mentality and emotional state. Now, Saturday the 21st, there is talk of karmic payout for hard work done. So anything that you've been working at, you're going to see benefit starting on that day or being loosened. Uh, Sunday the 22nd into Monday the 23rd. This is where some of you will be receiving additional benefits if you have put in the hard work. And for others, it isn't going to be that four-day stretch, that major change in transition in at least one area. For others, it's going to be about karma not being earned just yet. So keep up the hard work. If there's any unfinished business, skeletons in the closet, stuff swept under the carpet, make sure you deal with it now. And for some of you, it's just not time yet. The universe is handling it. It is right around the corner. But I feel like this is almost a 50-50 split for you, Aries. So we'll see. But definitely by Monday, you'll know where you stand. Now, on Monday the 23rd, we have the sun coming out for all of you regardless. That is the sun shining on your face, happiness, a reprieve to a situation. And for many of you, fireworks, which is a dynamic payout in at least one area. And I do feel that it's important to mention love on that day. So we could see a leveling up in love. This could be engagement, marriage. This could be growth of the family. It could also be you meeting a soulmate or you getting rid of cutting cords and untying yourself from something in the past that was not working, which allows for a new partnership to come in. Aries, have a beautiful week.